Love is in the air. The world event is right around the corner and we are sharing the love this holiday season. We've heard your feedback on the frustrations with X45 Heartbreaker's low drop rate. X45 Heartbreaker aka the love rocket. Yeah, so it has a low drop rate, we all know that. I mean, since 2005, something, when it came out, I've been doing it every year, on alts as well. So low drop rate and the feeling pressure of having to farm the mount by cycling through as many alts as possible every freaking day. From now on, the first heart-shaped box you receive each day across your Batnet account will have a greatly increased chance to contain X45 Heartbreaker mount. Does that mean that the other one will have like this really low drop drop chance? It sounds like they don't want you to go on your all your alts and do this. Any sub subsequent uh, heart shaped boxes you earn on your characters after the first each day will drop the mount at previous original rate. Yeah, so so the first one you do really high chance. The other ones will have the same chance. Love is in the air begins on February 6th at 6 uh, GMT in all regions. So spritz on your favorite perfume and head to the Shadow Fang Keep event dungeon to defeat Apothe something something Hummel for your chance at the fantastic flying fuchsia you fancied far what you fancied to fervently for what seems like forever. Okay, say that sentence five times really fast. Good luck, adventurers. All right, so. I mean, they they increase the they, they will increase the chance. The question is how how high have they increased it? It's gonna be interesting to see what how many people are gonna put on social media and Reddit and all that stuff about that they actually got it. Is it will it, will it be the same feeling if you got it now though? Let's say a lot of people get it now. It will be the same feeling since it's not the as low chance anymore. Greatly increased chance. Oh, there it is, guys. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna farm that stuff.